man terrorizes businesses, attacking people and assaulting police is now behind bars. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Tracy Cornett. And I'm Marius Payton. Tonight, our Sharon Dankwood joins us live after speaking with those business owners in Madison. And Sharon, they caught some of these attacks on video. Yeah, Marius, Tracy, employees caught this. You're looking at a man bashing a wooden club into the side of a food truck Saturday night, and the situation only got worse. Hit after hit. Ricardo says he stood in awe watching his food truck get destroyed and praying for police to arrive. I started screaming and wanted to assault my, uh, my workers. And here's how he says this all started. A guy, maybe in his round 50s, came to my restaurant and wanted free tacos. We told him no. He started, you know, screaming. But when Ricardo thought the issue was over, the man came back even angrier, and this time with a wooden club. And started screaming at me and said he was going to kill me and do this and that. Says the man sprinted over and whacked him in the arm. At that moment, I didn't know if he was going to you know, pull something out, maybe another weapon, maybe, you know, a firearm or something. Instead, he ran across Gallatin Pike to attack even more people at this restaurant before police showed up. They say the man is 52-year-old James Childress. Police say before Childress came to Ricardo's truck, he broke into this Aldi up the road. And after he was arrested, he kicked an officer in the chest, spat at paramedics, and assaulted nurses. I am scared. Don't know, you know if he may come back or get anybody to come back. I've now, Childress is facing multiple charges of assault, vandalism, aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Marius, Tracy. All right, Sharon Dankwa, thank you.